Hello, I am Sid, roving reporter with today's survey. The question, why do flowers have leaves? Maybe you can think about why flowers have leaves too. Okay, let's go get some answers. <laughs> oh, I got it. <laughs> hey, May, do you know why flowers have leaves? Um, well, maybe if flowers didn't have leaves, they'd fall back into the ground and become seeds again. Wow, <laughs> that's a good answer. Thanks, May. You're <laughs> welcome. <laughs> and ba -blam. Hey, Gerald. Oh, hey, Sid. Hi. Hey, do you know why flowers have leaves? Oh, yeah. Okay, you're going to like this answer. Great. <laughs> One time, it was raining. Shh. And then, okay, I saw drops of water on some leaves. So maybe the leaves were helping the flower to drink the water. <laughs> what do you think? Good answer, right? Yeah, that was a very good answer, Gerald. <laughs> and a very good elephant picture. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, elephant, Gerald. Bye, Sid. Regular. <laughs> hey, Gabriella. Hello. Do you know why flowers have leaves? Um. Well, I once saw a caterpillar eating a leaf. Like this. No, 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 no. So maybe leaves are food. Hmm, that's really interesting. Thanks, Gabriella. Sure thing. <laughs> wow. And now the results of my survey. May says that without leaves, flowers might fall down and become seeds again. Gerald says leaves help a flower to drink. And Gabriella says leaves might be food. Hmm. And maybe you thought about why flowers have leaves too. There you have it. I am Sid, roving reporter and leaf expert. Everybody, rug time. That's teacher Susie. Watch more on your local PBS station and the PBS Kids video app.